So let us say to God be the glory, great thing he has done. Wonderful God, he has kept us another week, he has kept us from harm and danger, he has kept us from trouble, and um, he is our uh, defender, our rock, our refuge. And um, as I have said many times, if you don't know him, my desire is that you get to know him. Um, it's, it's very late. Um, you know, I've spoken about the four angels holding back the four winds. Remember, we did a study about that, and we also did one about the, the fifth angel that was sealing the children of God. And it was calling and saying, Let's wait until we seal the servants of God, their fires. And you don't understand maybe these things, but for someone like me in spirit, I see those four angels like bracing back these winds, like the winds want to come down, you know, come down and they say like bracing them back, you know, bracing them back, bracing them back because they need to get the, 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 um, the okay from the, the fifth angel and the other crew to say that, well, the work is done and all the children of God are, I see it now and it's because when that is done then they are, um, they, angels who are holding back, we don't need to hold back anymore, you know, he's going to come back with a rushing, a, a mighty a rushing uh, wind, not like the one which came at the time with Pentecost, a Shavuot, right, when the day of, it was the rushing, that's going to come like when the, the waters came upon Pharaoh and his, um, and his army, who tried to cross the Red Sea after they saw Israel do it. I went through the midst of the, the road that was made. The road was not for them, so they shouldn't have gone in there. But when Moses stretched forth his rod, and it came in a rush. Right. Well, it's not Moses going to be stretching forth his rod this time. It's going to be the, his angels. They don't have to stretch for the right, it's dear right? Today we will be talking some more about these things. I think we can sing that song yet. A long while we haven't sung that song. I don't know if I can sing it at this point.
got a cordless going through it. You did upgrade to care the temperature, whether it was 76 degrees at the thermometer. Anyway, it wasn't too cold, but it cool and saturated the whole place. And I slept right to it. I slept right to it. But you know, I wasn't afraid. I wasn't afraid because I was saying to myself one day, I said, um, all these doors I have in this house here, I don't need them for security. Yeah, okay. So suppose I was in the woods, I would lie down there and sleep by myself. Sleep too, I would feel and wait. So I, I said I couldn't do it here. So the Lord showed it to me. So I wasn't afraid because I know I'm protected either way. Door open, my door closed. It doesn't matter. So, but it was something else because when I saw it, I said to myself, What? I said, Well, how did I make this mistake? not closing the back door but angels of God at the back door at the front door at the window everywhere so it doesn't matter and I remember this song which says anywhere with Jesus I can safely go anywhere with Jesus I can I can go to sleep anywhere with Jesus I'm not afraid maybe I should just sing that song maybe you know that Stuff and 
God with the stuff, but wake up, maybe see empty house or whatever. I don't worry about those things. You know. It's like my, my keys were right there hanging out. They could open the door, they could stick out the car, they could, I don't, you know, thinking about these things. I don't worry about this thing because I just prove to me over and over again that um, though you walk to the valley of the shadow of death, fear no evil because as David said, oh, it was me that I ride on this top. Hallelujah! 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 Yahweh, and say, Yahweh, should I not pretend to read it? I brought a nice staff, they comfort me. Amen. Now prepares the table for me. And I'm, I gotta say that I'm out from the top. Yahweh is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. Restores my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Hallelujah. Thou appearest the table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with all hell. My cup runneth over. Hallelujah. And surely goodness and mercy shall follow me. All the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. I think I missed a part there. The Lord, my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me by the still water. He restores my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Hallelujah. And then he goes to say, Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I'll fear no evil. With me. I run and I stop, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table for me in the presence of mine and his own. I just my head with all. My cup runneth over. Hallelujah, surely goodness and mercy shall follow me. Hallelujah, all the days of my life. Hallelujah. And I will dwell, and I dwell in the house of the Lord. seducing spirit you know, telling me that I shouldn't give this testimony now, maybe wait till next week. But um, the Lord spoke to me and said, I don't know about next week. So I said, I don't know about tomorrow, I don't know about next week, I don't know if there'll be another uh, next week, right, in this life. And I can't take this testimony into eternity or have any use over there. I need to say it now, okay. Right, uh, when my, our joys are fulfilled, my God, hallelujah! Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen, our Father. Amen. And the mountains are round about Jerusalem, so the Lord Yahweh is around about his people from henceforth even forever. Amen. Amen. The sun shall not, he said, the sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. Hallelujah. Yahweh shall preserve thee, he said, that from our evil. Amen. Amen. He shall preserve thy soul. Amen. Yahweh shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in, my God. Hallelujah. I am thanking God that I've lived to see amazing things as is written in the Bible. So when I come here and I talk about open the Bible, I personally am a living Bible. Okay? A living Bible. The things, a living epistle of the grace and the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. Alright, so. Um, I don't sing a worship and sing some songs I usually would, but my testimony here, testimony of the grace and the power as in Jesus Christ alone. I said, give it all to Jesus. Sorrow, he 
sing um, we're gonna pray and go into our days um, a lot of stuff a lot of stuff we've done all things well we have done all things well